Good morning, friends. This is Pastor Joe Palikathayal. I bring you greetings, greetings of the amazing love of the Lord Jesus Christ. Indeed, he loves us more than his, his own very life. He gave up his life on the cross that we may have life in abundance. Let us rejoice in that truth. We have been meditating about how to be a Christian. What does it mean to be a Christian? Today I invite you to meditate on John chapter 11 verse 44. The context is Jesus standing at the graveside of Lazarus and calling him out. Lazarus, come out. And the dead man came out, all wrapped up in grave clothes. Jesus says, take off those grave clothes from him and let him go. Let him live. Oh, what a powerful, wonderful, glorious miracle that was. What is it teaching to us? Sisters and brothers, though we are alive here upon earth, some of us still walk around with grave clothes. That means as if we are dead, we don't have any energy, enthusiasm, excitement in us. We take everything as routine. Yeah, what has to happen has to happen. Therefore, let's go through it. We are wearing grave clothes, dead people's clothes. Take it off. Jesus says, take it off and walk us alive, people. Put on clothes, that of the people who are alive. Put on the dignity and solemnity of Jesus Christ who is alive. Oh, what a powerful thing it is for us to put on the robe of righteousness and the shoes of dignity and the rings of authority and walk around. And do our thing. Do what Jesus wants us to do throughout this day. Sisters and brothers, whenever we feel, oh, there is no enthusiasm. Oh, we are tired. We are worn out. The same routine. Instead of grieving and dying, sisters and brothers, Jesus says, put off that great clothes. Take it off. And come on with me to live a radiant life. A life upon earth that is eternal. Oh, how powerful it is. Jesus is living within us in order to transform us into his living testimonies. Yes, we are called to live in Jesus. Jesus who is alive. And live for Jesus presenting the good news of Jesus by our life and as well as by our words. When people see us alive in Christ, they will ask, what's going on with you? Then he can say, don't you realize you are loved by the eternal Father, Lord God Almighty, you are a child of God, you are destined for eternity. Jesus is within you in order to help you to live a victorious life right here upon earth. Oh, sisters and brothers, let us ask the Holy Spirit to come upon us that we will live as people filled with fire, fire of love, wanting to give out the fire of love, fire of God's love, fire of our own love for one another. Will you join me in this prayer? Let us pray. Eternal Father, how can we thank you enough for the amazing love that you continue to pour upon us? Lord Jesus Christ, continue to live within us, teaching us to take off the grave clothes and put on the robe of your righteousness. O Holy Spirit, 
continue to come upon us, transforming us into your radiant disciples, into the people who contain and communicate the fire of your love. We ask this blessing, Father, in the name of Jesus. Amen.